everyone it's me Katrina from Katrina's Crochet World I hope you all are having a fantastic day today I am going to teach you how to do spiders on ladders so to get started I am using a 4.5 millimeter crochet hook and this is loops and threads it's a four medium four weight don't know where the ba yarn band went to so we're going to get started by doing a slip knot And to get started, you're going to chain a multiple of 11 plus 5. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And you keep doing 11 chains until you get to the length of your desire. So I just did 11 four times for my chain and now I'm going to add five. One, two, three, four, and five. Alrighty, so row one we're going to do a double crochet in the fourth chain from the hook and all the way across. So this chain on your hook does not count. You're going to count one, two, three, four and do a double crochet all the way across your chain. So yarn over your hook, insert, pull up a loop, three loops on your hook, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. And we're just going to repeat this all the way across. So I'm going to repeat this and I will meet you at the end and I will show you what to do next. Alrighty, so I am coming to my last stitch here and we're going to put double crochet in the last stitch. Now row two, we're going to chain three, which counts as a double crochet. Turn our work. We're going to skip the first double crochet and we're going to double crochet in each of the next two double crochets. So skip this one and we're going to crochet two double crochets in the next two double crochets. So that's one, two. We're going to chain three, skip the next two double crochets, skip, skip, and then we're going to treble in each of the next four double crochets. So skip these two and treble in the next four. So we're going to yarn over the hook twice, skip two, and then in the next four we're going to treble crochet. So you yarn over your hook twice, insert your hook, pull up the loop, four loops on your hook, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. That's one, two, three, and four. Now we're going to chain three, skip
skip the next two double crochets and two double crochet in each of the next three double crochets. So we're going to yarn over, skip two, one, two, and then in the next three, double crochet. There's one, two, and three. And you're going to repeat this pattern all the way across. And this is a five row repeat on this pattern that we are doing. So we're going to chain three, one, two, three, skip two, and then four treble in the next four double crochets. So yarn over your hook twice, skip two, and treble into the next. Insert your hook, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. And you're going to do that four times. There's two, three, and four. Now we're going to chain three. And we're going to do three double crochets. We're going to skip two and one double crochet in the next three stitches. So yarn over, insert your hook, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. Yarn over, jump over to the next stitch, insert your hook, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. There's your three double crochets, chain three. Now we're going to do four treble crochets. So you're going to skip those two double crochets and in the next four, one treble in each of the next four stitches. So you yarn over your hook twice, skip those two double crochets, and in the next yarn over your hook twice, insert your hook, pull up a loop. You'll have four loops on your hook. Yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. That's one. three and your fourth then you're going to chain three yarn over your hook skip two double crochets and one double crochet in the next three double crochets. So yarn over, insert your hook, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. There's one, two, and three. And then we're going to chain three. Now we're going to do our treble crochets. So yarn over the hook twice, skip those two double crochets and one double crochet in each of the next four double crochets. So skip, skip, yarn over the hook twice, insert your hook, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. There's one, two, 
two. Three. And four. Chain three. We're going to do skip the, those two and then you're going to do one double crochet in the next two double crochets and then in your chain three at the top of the chain three you're going to put your third double crochet so skip two yarn over the hook insert your hook into the third chain pull up a loop yarn over pull through two yarn over pull through two Jump over to the next double crochet and do your double crochet. Yarn over in the top of that chain three space. You're going to do your last double crochet. And at the end of every row, you're going to chain three before you turn your work. So chain three, turn your work. That's what it looks like so far. And then row three, you're going to, this chain three counts as your double crochet. So you're going to skip that first double crochet. And you're going to yarn over, go into the second double crochet, and do your one double crochet. Yarn over, insert your hook into the next one, do your double crochet. And we're going to chain three. Above each treble crochets, you're going to do one single crochet in each of those four triple crochets. So that's your double and these are your triples. So all in the top of the triple crochets, all the way across. And then your, where your double crochets are is where you're going to do your double crochets on the top. So we chained three. We're going to skip this chain three space, jump over on top of your treble crochets and do your single crochet. There's one, two, three, four, chain three, and then we're coming over to our double crochets. And we're going to put three double crochets in the top of our double crochets. So yarn over, skip this chain three space, double crochet. There's one, two, three, and three. Chain three. Now we're coming to our three, or sorry, four triple crochets. So we're going to do one single crochet in the top of each of those tri triple crochets. So insert your hook, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two. There's one, two, three, and four. And then we're going to repeat this all the way across chain three back to our double crochet so one double crochet in each of those three chain three Single crochet in the top of those tri triple crochets. Chain three. Double crochet in the top of those three double crochets.
chain three, one single crochet in the top of those four triple crochets. chain three. Now we're coming to our last three double crochets, so we're going to double crochet in the top of this one, double crochet in the second, and then we're going to do a double crochet in the top of that chain three space. So yarn over, at the top of that chain three space do your last double crochet just gonna move that up a little bit there we go. chain three turn your work So that chain three counts as your double crochet. So we're going to yarn over, skip the first one, go into the second, do your double crochet, yarn over, double crochet, chain three, and here's your three double three single crochets so we're going to do another set of three single crochets one two three and four chain three then we're going to jump over do three double crochets in the next three spaces One, two, and three. Chain three. One single crochet in the top of those four single crochets. chain three, double crochet in the next three chain spaces, chain three, one single in each of the four single crochets, at the top, chain three, three double crochets, Chain three, four single crochets, chain three, then we're going to do our two double crochet. And at the top of that chain three, we're going to do our last double crochet. Chain three, turn our work. So when we're doing, just to explain this a little more, when we're doing the single crochets at the top of our uh, single crochets, you're going to do three rows 
of the single crochets. So you will have the way to find out that you have done four, technically four, count these chains, these three chains, and make sure you have four of these chains and you will know that you have done three rows of those single crochets just to keep track of what you have done and so you know that you've done three this where you do your three double crochet or sorry your three single crochets and then three double single double all the way across just make sure you have four of these chain threes <laughs> So that chain three counts as your double crochet. You're going to skip the first double crochet, double crochet into the next, double crochet into the next, chain three, single crochet into the next three single crochets, sorry, four single crochets. And see, you, you have four now. You got one, two, three, four. And with this pattern, like I said, you're going to re, you're going to repeat rows two to seven, which is five row repeat. So chain three, one double crochet, and the next three double crochets. chain three, one single crochet in the next four single crochets, chain three, three double crochets, chain three, one single crochet in the next four, chain three, three double crochets in the top of the double crochets, chain three, one single crochet in the next four single crochets, chain three, one double crochet in the next two double crochets, And then double crochet in the top of that chain three space. Chain three and turn your work. This is what your work would look like so far. Okay, so now we have gotten our four done here. So Again, this chain three counts as our double crochet. So we're going to yarn over, skip this one, jump over to our second, do our double crochet, yarn over, another double crochet, chain three, and in the top of those three double, three single, sorry, four single crochets, we're going to do four triple crochets. So yarn over the hook twice, 
top of the single crochet insert pull up a loop four loops on your hook yarn over pull through two yarn over pull through two yarn over pull through two there's one two three four and we're going to chain three three double crochets in the top of the double crochets one two three chain three then we're going to do four triple crochets in the top of those four single crochets yarn over your hook twice insert your hook pull up a loop four loops on your hook yarn over pull through two yarn over pull through two yarn over pull through two and we're going to do that four times yarn over the hook twice insert your hook pull up a loop four loops on your hook yarn over pull through two yarn over pull through two yarn over pull through two and we're just going to repeat this across chain three you're going to do your three double crochets chain three four triple crochets chain three and then your three double crochets chain three four triple crochets chain three and then when you come to the end you're going to do two double crochets at the top of those two double crochets and your double crochet at the end of the chain so I'm going to keep going and I will meet you at the end so I am at my end here where my chain three is and I'm going to put my last double crochet in the top of that chain three space chain three turn my work and now all the way across we're just going to do one double crochet in each stitch and each of the chain three space we're going to do two double crochets so that chain three counts as a double crochet so we're going to skip the first one go into the second do your double crochet double crochet and then in the chain three space make two double crochets And then on top of the four triple crochets in each of those do one double crochet and there's no chaining in this one and then two double crochets in that chain three space And then three double crochets in the top of your double crochets I think this would make a beautiful top two double crochets in your chain three space one double crochet in the top of the each of those three or four triple crochets and you're just going to repeat this all the way across until you get to the end
So I'm going to work along and I will meet you at the end. Okay, so I'm at the end here. I made my two double crochets. I'm going to put the last double crochet in the top of that chain three space. So that is the total pattern right there. So all you're going to do is repeat row two to seven. So row two is where you do your chain three, two double crochets, chain three, four triple crochets, chain three and you skip two, three double crochets, chain three, skip two, three treble crochets, chain three, you skip two, three double crochets all the way across, row three, that chain three counts as your double crochet, so you skip your first one, you do one double crochet in the next two double crochets, chain three, four single crochets, chain one, three double crochets, chain three, four single crochets, chain three, three double crochets, chain three, four, four single crochets, chain three, and you repeat that all the way across. And then when you get to the end, you do your two double crochets and then a double crochet in that chain three and then you chain three, turn your work. And like I said, just make sure you're doing it three times. You're doing three sets of the single crochets. Make sure you have four of these chain threes. And then when you get to the other top, you're going to chain three, skip the first double crochet. And in the next two double crochets, you're going to do two double crochets chain three, three triple crochets, chain three, three double crochet, chain three, three triple crochets, chain three, and repeat that all the way across. Then you're going to chain three, skip the first double crochet, and you're going to double crochet in the first two double crochets, and in the chain three space, you're going to do two double crochets, four double crochets, two double crochets in the chain three, three double crochets in the top of the du three double crochets, two double crochets in your chain three space, four double crochets in the top of the triple, four triple crochets, and you just repeat that all the way across. Again, you repeat rows two to seven. I think this would make a beautiful top or a cowl. It's a very, very pretty pattern, I think. Um, like I said, I just used a 4.5 millimeter crochet hook on this. It does rec recommend, I think, a five millimeter crochet hook depends on if you want it to fit tightly or if you want it to be a loose stitch. I hope you all enjoyed this tutorial and I, I would love to see what you guys make out of this. And if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. And I want to say welcome back to my, my channel for the new subscribers that have became uh, members or subscribed to my channel and welcome back to the um, old timers. And if you'd like to become a member, please hit that join button. There's three terrors. Um, all my links are in my description box. If you would like to uh, purchase, purchase my merches, there is a Teespring link in there as well. There's a PayPal coffee where you can donate money, um, which will go towards the uh, channel as well. So I hope you all have a fantastic day. You all take care. Stay safe and happy crocheting. Bye everyone.